What is going on gamers? Avatrix here and I am back from Hong Kong from the event that I went to. So I'm finally back. The jet lag is gone so I'm good to go. Now if you follow my snapchat which will be on the right somewhere over there. Um, you pretty much saw a lot of the things that I did and that I saw on Hong Kong. If you haven't at my snapchat because I do have a funny story that happened to me in immigration. So if you haven't added it, add it. But I did made one mistake. This account right here is on my guest account and I forgot to link it to an email so unfortunately I wasn't able to play while I was there but it's completely fine because I was able to come back and snatch this thing up that was a special for yesterday so we do get an event legendary hero card now honestly I don't really think that I need anything from there like there's a few things that I would want like a dread drake a skull knight etc but i don't know if i really need anything because i'm i'm actually quite happy with the five that i have right now in cupid lil nick trixie treat Gulum, and pumpkin duke so if i was to get something i would probably want a damage dealer but it might just be for the six hero base so let's just first of all let's open that up and see if we get anything decent if not we're, we're okay we don't necessarily need anything so legendary event hero card what do we get do we get a skull knight and we get a mm, harpy queen that's not that's not bad it's definitely not one that i have so that in itself is good enough do i want to unlock a slot for 50 gems why not and I believe that's a that's a Pokemon. Why not? Anyways, let's open up this Harpy Queen and check it out. It's gonna come with five of five revitalize. I'm calling it right now. Best Harpy Queen revive. Okay, one of a revive. Not the best for, but for a free to play, is actually not too bad either. So my heroes are quite leveled up. Not really um, the fastest way to level them up or anything like that, but I'm not trying to grow this account at a crazy rate. I'm just enjoying it, the progression and whatnot. And as you probably can tell, I did change the base a little bit, and it's more like a death box. If you guys remember the old, the old school death box, this is it. And the base and the troops that I have is because I want to try HBMI once again. Now, the name of the game on that HBM is... To kill the spirit mage as quickly as possible and we all know that that can be a little rough especially if they come from all corners all the time it can be rough but nonetheless we will give it a shot HBMI are we going to do decently this time we will have to see so here we go it comes from the top right okay that's not bad now we just need to take out the spirit mage as quickly as possible Okay, Lil Nick is going to help with the troops. I like that. Oh my, okay, that's not good. And did we die? Okay, so Pumpkin Duke is dead. This is, this is not looking good. That was not what I really was looking for. And I don't know if I should end it there. I should probably end it there. Yeah, let me conserve my troops because I want, I want us to have some troops for another attempt because... We went down a little too er too fast on that. And this is where somebody like a Vlad would come in really handy. Because Vlad would uh, would actually hit everything and kill the Spirit Mage too. But the heroes that I have don't really have that type of, uh, that type of skill to hit everything at once. So, I don't know. I think we're going to have to get a little bit lucky. But let's give this shot another shot here. Uh-oh. Did we freeze? Uh oh, what happened game? We absolutely froze. Okay, there we go. Okay, that was a little... Okay, and now they're coming from the bottom. I don't know if that's beneficial or not, but we're just gonna pretend like it is. We will have to see though. Um, if we if we can just have all of my heroes not die in the first wave, I would consider that a victory. But that's just me. Who died? Who died? Did anybody die? Pumpkin Duke is still alive. Everybody is still alive. Hold on to your hats. Everybody is still alive. And they're coming from the same spot, which is actually, again, very beneficial. I don't know what happened to the game. After that little thing, whatever it was, everything just kind of lagged out. 
Now, I don't like Ghulam giving the Spirit Mage all that energy. I don't like it, and I don't like all that self-destruct that we got going on. What I do like, however, is Ghulam getting his proc off, topping off everybody, and now getting some energy. So we're, we're good. Hey, top right. I mean, that's, that's actually not too bad. As long as the next two waves don't come from these two sides. Like, please, game. And actually, them coming from that side is uh, pretty much like a favor to us. Because this other side is kind of destroyed. Oh, the, the, okay. The Spirit Mage did not hit anybody. We're kind of running a little low on Guardians now. But we need these waves to not come from there. And it does not. This is looking good for us. We might actually make it. This Spirit Mage. Mm, Pumpkin Luke is going to get a proc off. Which is going to be beneficial. Spirit Mage was silenced. Which is A-OK. -okay, and we're going to go to I-5. With everybody alive and two corners alive, which is exactly what I need. Can we pull this through? And actually, that spawn, once again, is actually quite beneficial. I am liking my odds right now. We just need to take care of these foot soldiers, these little hulks, as I call them. Oh, God. This, the lag. What's up with the lag? Kill the spirit mage. The spirit mage is dead. Is this... Yes! I-5 completely defeated okay it kicked my ass the first go around but you see that this base does work you just need a little bit of luck with the spawns and we did get a bit lucky because most of them did spawn on the bottom which was perfectly fine because it left spirit mage to proc on these guardians up top and then at the end the base did all the work for us so we finally beat i i'm not feeling too confident about j just yet i feel like I should level up my walls a little bit more, probably take my, my heroes up a star level. And I don't have the HP or the HB for that just yet, so I'm going to hold off for now. But we did make some good progress, and for the dungeons, we did actually clear out dungeon 8. So right now, I can go ahead and sweep the 40 shard dungeon, which we all know was the dungeon back in the day. So we're going to go ahead and sweep that a little bit more. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching, and until later, bye!